Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel, it's me again, AG Dream Hunter. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and do share to your friends. So today, I am just walking right here at Mountain View. Uh, we just came home from, from um, Magalang, so that's kind of far from here, so... I'm just gonna share you guys this is the place of mountain view I know all of you already hear this place because there are a lot of, of vloggers who's walking on this place and showing you in this place what's going on here I mean uh, right at this time it is already four o'clock in the afternoon so that's Genshi's walking uh, we are going to bakery we're just gonna get some of my favorite bread ever so there's a bakery somewhere there but i don't i don't really like it there so i have a favorite bakery somewhere near in um talipapa talipapa it means the small my market so we call the talipapa so <clears throat> we've been in magala and it's kind of far from the from the area where we are where we at now we are in in a balibago and then we found a place there in magalang so when we say magalang it means <clears throat> it is it's kind of far, far from from balibago where i am staying now where my apartment now so i find a place there and it is cheap there's two rooms and um one big garage and it came from I mean, it came with. Um, ah, ah, okay, let me do it. Let me say it again. Uh, it's a big place, two rooms, one big garage, and uh, it came with a store in front. That is six stop six. Sorry, six thousand six thousand and five hundred pesos. So six thousand five hundred pesos. It's cheap with the two rooms, and then one big garage. You have your own gate, and then there's. A store already plus all shelves that you need on your store but the problem is it's far because from here in our place we have to take a trike 50 pesos and then we're going to the Marky Mall from Marky Mall to that place so that's the Jeep is 30 pesos so it's like it's already 80 pesos then when we get out from the from the jeepney we have to pay another track again to to go to the exact location and it is another 40 pesos so it's kind of 120 pesos so if you do it every day so it is more than uh, three thousand pesos a month just for the fare so six thousand five hundred plus the let's say three uh, three thousand to be exact in one month so that is already nine thousand five hundred and fifty well that is more than more than a, no nine thousand nine thousand five hundred uh more than 9,500 so if you do the math and then if you're gonna let your brain work it out so it's like you are getting like 10,000 pesos near here where I am at now with a uh, with a uh, two rooms in a big garage in front you know because yeah 6500 plus the fare every day you know so it's like uh you know it's not it's not good so i i don't really want to go far away from this place because this place um you know there's a lot of people in this place but there are a lot of people also there but there are a lot okay there are a lot of stores already there so it's no good to to have a business there you know sometimes sometimes there are cases that we have to think before we click because um, 
it might be cheap but the fare is very expensive and then put it together so if you put it together it's the same it's the same price the the balibago price so sometimes we just we just need time think and then realize if it is really good so right in here i mean right in this area where we are walking now there's also a place that is for rent there is one bedroom upstairs and a um, big area downstairs where you can put the store like like that what you are seeing now in the video but the problem but the problem also is the down payment the down payment here is like two two months deposit one month advance plus five water and up five thousand um, down payment for the electric bill and um, five uh, three thousand for the water bill so we need 38 thousand pesos move in <laughs> that is crazy man that is really expensive you know it's really crazy but you know you're not gonna regret uh, after all because it's it's a good place it's a good spot for you to to have a store then you can you can sell anything that you wanted to put there you know it's like you can put uh, rice or like what you're seeing on the video you know um, like a dry you know dry foods or uh, like fish you know because this area is or a fruit stand you know as i always say this place is very nice to have a business so look at those um vegetables just in the ground but i already took one of the men they're working i don't know if they are the owner or maybe they are just working but guys it's like they are 24 hours there at the sidewalk and they earn a big money not i don't even i don't even reach that here on my store but they did they earn big money so just just in the sidewalk okay but you know i, I don't want to be on the sidewalk that 24 hours or even 12 hours i don't want to be in the sidewalk hello <laughs> but most of them of the sidewalk vendors on that area most of them are men like for the the fruit standard is also um 24 hours so that area also is for rent before but because i don't have the money for the payment yet so i don't get it so that that's already uh about three years ago but that is a very nice spot also that is an eatery and that i am pointing now is that the one that ten thousand pesos a month which is the 38,000 pesos down payment that's the last one I've been pointing on so we are already here in front of 7-eleven um, here in the in mountain view so that's my favorite bakery where I always go because I, I like to to get uh, the fried bread which is the binangkal so with the uh, sesame seeds so when you walk forward there right here you can also a lot of street foods you know that is the lemon juice uh, lemon no it's not lemon I don't know I forgot that's not orange also I'm ah, mango that is mango juice and then a boku juice and also you can see also right here that's a street food it's a quail egg that's a fish bowl or something else a lot of that you can see here on the street and also at the back of that girl who is measuring that juice is the um the guy i've, I've known him so long i mean long time ago he is selling that uh vegetables so as you can see this is in front of mcdonald's mcdonald's is right there and uh, the fields uh i forgot the hotel but there's jane as you can see there's a lot of fruits also so right at this time we are heading home but as you can see there's a lot of stores and that is my favorite um a grilled pork or lichung baboy that is located in front of mcdonald's and that taste is like a taste in um 
Cebu lechon but they called it Cebu lechon but I think they're just use the name Cebu lechon because you know Cebu lechon is like famous very famous when you go to Cebu so when you go to Cebu you should you should try the the lechon I mean the grilled pork so we called it lechon so right on this area this is going to barangay balibago or going to our place but before you get there before before you get to balibago you can see this uh, peanut vendor a fried chicken vendor and a lot of them i i don't i just don't uh see it them now but their buku juice vendors and um like a tusuk tusuk i don't know how you, how to say that in english in tusuk tusuk but it's like uh i've already i already have a vlog before with cg abroad uh maro piazza the uh, bien alcario I forgot his name and uh, chubby Jane already guys if you have time please also check Jane's uh, chubby at uh, chubby Jane's channel she is going to start uploading a video because I told her she had to because you know she got already reached the subs the subscriber so please help also her growing her channel so that is for today's video beautiful people thank you thank you for watching and please don't forget to give me a thumbs up leave a comment if you like the, the video or not <laughs> just leave a comment thank you thank you so much everybody please don't forget to like subscribe and click the notification bell button so you will be updated or on, on our next videos thank you thank you so much guys um please share it to your friends if you would like to share guys always remember that sharing is caring so you should share this video to your friends or my or my channel bye guys love you all see you on my next vlog bye bye everybody take care